I thought I'd be quite slow because this is the first one this year. Hello and welcome to the vlog. We're in Split. It's early on a Sunday morning. Rona's about to run the half marathon. Yep, I am. First one of the season, so let's see how it goes. And the big story about all of this, if you're someone who's on social media and follows Rowan on there, is you know she's um, being sponsored to raise money for new instruments for Limited Glass, but I'm going to explain more about why that's really important very soon. for people who are English might sound like some random thing but it means brass band, brass music and uh, behind us is a split Lumino glass band. So in Yaitza we also have a Lumino glass band um, but some of our musical instruments have been around nearly as long as the orchestra which is over a hundred years and uh, yeah they're not really working anymore and we've got a bunch of new kids who are wanting to join the orchestra which is really important because we really need um, a new generation to join the orchestra but there aren't enough instruments for them so that's why I'm running to raise money so that we can buy instruments for them. The guy who has been leading Limina Glasgow for the last uh, a lot a lot of years, I'm not sure how many exactly, um, has retired and so yeah, they asked me if I would take on the role of conductor, so I said yes and it's an interesting journey. But I hope getting these new instruments and encouraging these young kids to join the orchestra is gonna make a big difference. And one of the really good things about this orchestra is that it's one of the few organizations in town, along with Nobby Moss, um, that it's not exclusive to any particular group of people, so everybody's welcome. It doesn't matter what background they come from, what religion they have, everybody's welcome and that's really important. Limina Glasper as well and I think this is the one called Pozdrav Soyadrana which is very applicable because it means greetings from the Adriatic Sea and that's where we are right now. So we put on a vlog that Rowan and I and a woman from Zenitza did like a relay for a half marathon back in Banja Luka probably a year or so back and uh, I did the first leg and I started off running behind Dina and she was wearing a uh, Lavavi floorball top. So the regular logo is designed to have half of a floorball ball on it and the lion's head and as I was running behind her for the first kilometre I was like we could change that and we could make it a foot and it could be a running logo and well it's always nice when the plan comes together. Yesterday in the 5k race I'm officially the first person to have crossed the finish line wearing one of those t-shirts. It wasn't a particularly glorious run but you know you got to take these small victories when you get them. Today the course story is about Rowan and being you know, running a half marathon and particularly about Rowan and the fundraising for Limina Glasgow which is really exciting it's something that will make a really big difference to the work she's doing with the orchestra in town so uh, yeah it's going to be a good day fun so for anyone who's not familiar with half marathon start procedures there's start zones so Dina's down there in zone 3 she's going to run slightly Rowan's in zone D, the back here, and then you've got obviously B and A, and then elite runners right in front of the start line. A long way down here, but you won't you won't be able to see that. So your time comes off the chip in your number bib. So there's no massive advantage of, of being first over the start line. Five, four, three, two, one, go! There you go, Rowan's off. I'm going to go and find breakfast. So, yeah, breakfast. There are worse places to have breakfast. I can't tell where the journey will end, but I know where it's on. Toliko puno svita da ne može ni ovi sustavi, ova moderna tehnologija. 
Did you see me come over? Yeah. yeah. So you can get your medals engraved before you finish. Uh -huh. everyone who's donated um, for instruments for Limena Glasva as part of me running this half marathon. Really, really grateful for that and I'm sure all the kids who are going to play the instruments will also be really grateful. And uh, yeah, we'll update you with how the instruments look when we get them. Yeah, we've got one more thing to show you before we uh, wrap the vlog up for this week. And uh, this made Rome particularly happy. It's a little engraving above the door in the, the room that we rented for the couple of nights and Rowan will point it out to you now. It says M and R. Like a few hundred years ago whenever this little building was made somebody knew we were going to stay here this weekend and they put our name on the door. It's pretty cool. So there you go. Thanks very much for watching. Do give us a big thumbs up for running, particularly for running half marathons. And for the generosity of people supporting Limina Glasgow and York, so do leave a comment, a question if you want to know more, and do remember that together we do adventure. We'll see you next time.